I was initially seconded to Alexandra Hospital uh, when COVID first uh, broke out. We wanted to volunteer our, our, our services and our skills as cabin crew to actually try and better the journey of patients here. So we were all really just uh, deployed to different hospitals uh, way back then. Seems like a very long time ago. Currently, I'm actually uh, working with inpatient ops inside the wards in Alexandria Hospital. Uh, we actually do financial counselling for our patients. So, so back then when I was in Singapore Airlines, uh, our duty as a, as a cabin crew is really to provide a service for passengers that are travelling with us. I always look forward to landing in a different country. Uh, personally for me, I was really enjoying the different, the different sort of food all over the world. Uh, you would realise that the demographics that we actually serve is, is really very different. It's an entirely different atmosphere. I spent uh, a good couple of months actually considering and contemplating whether or not I want to leave the airline. Being on the ground uh, actually exposed me to the benefits of having a routine. I can uh, go do what I like or even pick up a spot on the side like, like bouldering, which is something I do now. I have one patient that I used to take care of uh, as a care ambassador and occasionally the, the patient comes back to the hospital and I just saw him about a week ago and we can strike up a conversation just like that, you know, asking how's he doing and sort of providing this continuous care beyond that initial admission. Of course, you know, with, with, the, with the difference in, in, in any financial remunerations from different jobs, you would be concerned, you know, especially with um, the ever-changing financial climate and, and prices on the rise. At the same time, it has been extremely rewarding and uh, really see myself growing um, where towards what I want to be as a person both professionally and personally.